Welcome back crafters to another weekly giveaway from Crafts You Print. Before I show you this week's freebie, let me tell you all about selling your handmade cards within the site. If you purchase something on the site, you can then upload a photo of your handiwork and enable sales on the item so a customer can purchase your finished item directly from you. And listen to this, we do not take any commission when a sale is made. All the sale price goes to you. How neat is that? Let me show you a short presentation which will tell you all about selling your items. Okay folks, it's freebie time. This week we have a stunning 3D Xmas shaped card mini kit by exclusive designer Carol Clark. The cup number for this week's freebie is cup 918159 underscore 359. This kit consists of two sheets. We've got the card front uh, and the back, and we've got greeting sentiments, just there, look, and an optional layer of uh, decoupage with holly. Let me just show you what it looks like completed. I think it's fabulous. As you can see there, look, we've got the card front. Um, we've used the uh, optional holly there to decoupage. We've got some lovely Christmas ribbon. Um, we've got a lovely snowflake and some beautiful uh, silver star like ribbon coming down and we've got a lovely blue star there that's matching with the card another snowflake and um, we've got a lovely 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 little um, teddy bear snowman there but just look the simplicity of these lovely lovely little snowballs just really add to it I think that is brilliant lovely Christmas tree and look, look on the back. As you can see, it's added to the card there. Got a lovely sentiment there. Lots and lots of space for you to put your own message on there. I think this is a fabulous keepsake card. It's simple to make. It looks really stunning when it's made up and it will wow the recipient. Everything you need to make a really gorgeous shaped card like this one. This card will fit into a standard C5 envelope for posting. There are a number of greeting sentiments uh, as well as a blank one for your own greeting included uh, in the kit. So you're really versatile for anyone to choose whether they want one already made or your own. There are many, many more of Carol's 3D shaped card kits to choose from and they would make a great set of cards to sell at craft fairs. Don't forget to find and follow Carol Clark next time you visit Crafts You Print. Full step-by-step -step instructions are also included in the download as well as the video tutorial. I will now hand you over to our lovely Anne-Marie for you to watch. Over to you Anne-Marie. Hi everyone, my name's Anne-Marie. Welcome to this episode of Cup TV. Brought to you by Crafts you Print from www.craftsuprint.com Now we're going all Christmassy today. I know it's a little bit out of season, but you know, 
us crafters love Christmas all year round. So why not do something at this time of year just to, you know, put you back in the Christmas spirit. This design is from Carol Clark and it's cup number cup 918159 underscore 359 and it's called the 3D shaped Christmas snow globe card kit and it's the little westy dog. Now in the kit you get two sheets and the instructions. This is perfect if you are a new crafter or if you are a seasoned crafter. And it's going to look great on anybody's windowsill or mantelpiece. I just think it's a really cool design and really fun design for Christmas. So the sheets that you get in the kit are, you get sheet number one with the snow globe on, which is the front of the card. You get lots of sentiments as well. And then you get the back of the card and it says Merry Christmas on it. And then you also get the actual piece that's going to join the cards together and a little bit of extra holly. Now I've got to say the instructions show exactly where to score everything and where to put your tape. So what we're going to do is follow the instructions and make a gorgeous Christmas snow globe card. So the first thing that I've got is the front of the card. Now I've actually gone ahead and added a little bit of glitter. I don't know if that's going to pick that up. But just where the snow's falling, I've just added a little bit of glue and some clear crystal um, glitter. So that's the front of my card. This is the back of the card. I've scored it along the line that it shows to score on the actual sheet. So I've done that. And I've also added tape, double sided tape on the back of it. So I can peel my tape away. This is flat double sided tape. And then I'm going to take the front of the card and bring the back of the card to it. And I'm going to marry up the two shapes like so to the best of my abilities and press down. Now I have that effect but because we've scored it we can make sure that's a nice sharp fold and just give it a little run with the bone folder or something to make sure you've got that as a nice sharp fold. So let's not forget this is the back of the card and that's the front. So I've taken the section that's built for, shall we say, the stand-up mechanics of the card. I've scored it as it says and I've got mountain and valley folds. Mountain folds go upwards, valley folds go downwards. And I've added tape on both sides of the actual, um, not on both sides, on one side but on both edges, that's what I'm trying to say. And if you're confident, do both at the same time or if you're not confident, just do one at a time. I'm pretty confident and I'm going to turn um, this section and put it into my card and I'm putting it I want you to be able to see so we'll do it that way so I'm putting it at the base of the card like so because this is what's going to make it stand up so I'm just positioning it to the edge of the card in the centre like that press it down and now you could peel the other side of the tape away and then we fold this section down, press it down, smooth it along and hopefully, as if by magic, that will stand up. Now I know, obviously with the camera view, but that you've just seen how that stands up like that. And now we can decorate it. So I've already got a little bit of crystal glitter on there. I've cut out two of the messages 
and I've just got a little bit of 3D tape on the back of them. So I'm going to add one at the side of the Westie's head and I'm going to add a little bit of holly just to the side of the message. And then the second message I've cut out Christmas wishes that I'm going to put towards the bottom of the snow globe. And I've just got the extra little bit of holly for the side of the sentiment. And add that just about there. There we go. And that is a fun Christmas card made. Stands up perfectly and it's just adorable. So Carol's got lots of designs to choose from. So please have a look. And the cup number for this uh, kit is cup nine one eight one five nine underscore three five nine and i do hope you've enjoyed just a sprinkling of christmas so thank you for watching and i shall see you next time thanks for that Anne marie i really love the way you made this week's freebie thank you remember this freebie is only online for seven days and then it will revert back to the usual price, which is £1.20. Just a quick reminder of the cup number. The cup number this week is cup 918159 underscore 359. Thanks for watching, crafters, and thanks to both Carol Clark and Anne Marie Vo for this week's show. See you next time, crafters, and don't forget to share the link to this episode if you would like to see more. Bye for now, and remember, folks, sharing means caring. Bye!